So I never, never really expected to get into making R S three content, but I kind of really like this update. I don't know why. Maybe it's because it reminds me just slightly of um. Pokemon, and I really like playing Pokemon. There's actually this Pokemon game, MMORPG, that got released, it's free, and I've been following it on Discord, and so far it's really nice, so you guys should check it out, but anyways, moving over here to the farm, which is what this is all about, I'm trying to make children, <laughs> uh, okay. I guess I can remove her. Give them a chance to have another child. Oh! Wait. There are spirit spiders in these pretty. That's pretty cool. Anyways. Yeah. As you can also see in the inventory, you know. If you play the game, these are from um, the Ark, the mushroom clusters. I've been trying to do that as well. Because, you know, I eventually want to. Get comp and such. So, yeah, I don't really know what else to say to be fair. I'll probably come back in another clip with maybe something, but you can expect some RS3 videos because I kind and I'm just running back and forth <laughs> because I do I do really like this update and it's brought back a little bit of the feel of the game for me and you know I got a new laptop which was mainly what prevented me from playing it before just have to you have to do that here now <sighs> well I guess you can do it while watching you yeah, things grow but ugh. anyways We'll see you guys in another clip, more than likely. Probably. Yes, you'll notice I'm still here, and please don't um, don't at me about my bank, please. Why am I certainly on Word. not letting me withdraw <laughs> my Instagram account. Okay. Well, that was pretty strange. But I was getting the insect um, repellents I could go for the bee. Collect some honey. Because well, these, these raise their happiness, and this one raises their health. And I think the, they get better odds of breeding, and like better species, the happier and obviously more healthy they are. Oh, you hear that crawling? That's kind of that's kind of adorable. Freaks me out, but it's kind of adorable. Your bill. So you're the female who's lucky. So let's make you happy. And healthy. Because I, I, I do have a lot. And spiders. Next to. Next to yaks. Are basically like. The next best thing as far as I'm concerned. And I do try to farm yak sometimes, but I wish they showed you how many you killed, because wow, <laughs> I've I've slayed a lot of them at this point. Uh, Sixty-five, eighty-eight, and you're how much? Fifty-one, four. I guess we can start giving you some health is after we give you a few more. Seventy-five. So that's my thing. Put 
so no good. It's pretty healthy. It's halfway happy. She all the happy, all the healthy, healthy sign. More than likely going to go to this or try to if not. Hey guys, welcome to that entertaining B content. Oh, this one had a lot more. Let's see. Oh, okay. If you guys are new to this place, by the way, this over here to the eastern side is the breeding section. Now you can, I think, update. I'll show you after this. Let's make it a hundred. And we can do the same for her more than likely. But I think this will boost him to 90. Yeah, that's fine. And she's easy, so there's one more. Yeah, I can show you guys that. Random pet. <laughs> Just trying to remember. Yeah. This used to be hard on farm, but they changed the area a little bit. I haven't really explored past here to be fair. Mm. This one here is medium paddock, which you know, put your stuff in. This is too large, put your other stuff in. I don't have any right now because yeah. it would just be me raising cows and bleh. You know what? I do have a cow fence here, and there's nothing in there, so maybe I should. Anyways. These are the two small ones, so you usually put like your bunnies or your chickens, and there's another one in there. But you start off by talking to this one, and just follow her tutorial, and pretty simple. Shows you where you want to go, all of that. And you can buy all these things as you so own about four upgrades, which is the small Z pen that. That, that, that. We can get these by the master of pharma, hold for blueprint to make them better upgrades to the herbicide and such. That's pretty dangerous. Yeah. All pretty simple. And I think it's fun. I think it's a good way to go about doing certain things, I hope they add more, like, hmm. I mean, yeah, they have dragons, but, I'm trying to think what, <laughs> what would be cool to have, or what do you guys think would be cool to have? So, oh, <laughs> I was about to say I'm back on this spot, and it, for so long, oh, it's doing it. Same weird freaky thing again where it just won't let me click. Anyways, I was just about to record that this next spot is also pretty drained, but I got one of the new mushrooms I needed regardless, so hopefully that look continues and we can finish this up in no time. <laughs> because I'll probably end up having to run to the other side where the malignant entity goes to. But Maybe this will last for a minute, and I'll be able to get back to home. Oh, I'm already able to. Alright. I guess I have no worries. I just have to keep looking out for that lady until I get it. But I still don't have the ability to click. So I'll figure that out again for some reason. I might have something to do with the recording. I'm not sure. Though. Yeah. I wasn't able to catch the recording but I got I think what is the last and the new mushroom that should be for this reason I believe it is isn't it let's see butter cap yeah I'm gonna have to check but I think it's the last one
Yes, it was definitely the last one. So what I'm going to do now is head to the island that was once, well, once was turtles or something like that, and finish up that. I only have two left to get, so that shouldn't take long as well. But then again, this one took a while. So I'll see you guys at the first mushroom cluster, just like I did with this one. But um, yeah. I, sh I might make a little stop at my um, Uncharted Island to pick up some ancestral energy so I can unlock the final um, teleport between islands with that because I'm pretty sure it's going to be included in the quest series and I'm going to need to travel for some reason or the other. Yeah, anyways, catch you guys in the next one. Okay, so we're on the Uncharted. Uncharted on God and on Charted Island. Yeah. Get some ancestral energies. <clears throat> Actually I kinda like this island because it has um it has these obviously. It has a golden bamboo spawn, two LAO salt crabs, and one sea salt crab. Lots of bamboo. Uh, that's it though. So I'll probably have to spend a couple supplies on Charted Hopping to attempt to find some ones with mushrooms because I know that the mushrooms are on that. And I feel like I kind of want to get the mushrooms done. <coughs> Excuse me. I kind of want to get the mushrooms done before the rest because it seems in a way like it could be the easiest or it could be the hardest and I mean either way it's still knocking something out that I'll probably have to do so this is it though and I'm just collecting a few of that but oh those were positive energies oh I always thought these were these that were in my inventory were ancestral but I need 50 ancestral regardless so I'll be here for like a little bit Probably should have gotten my divine outfit, but mm, too lazy. We got energy. Okay, okay, okay. Do, do. Well, it turns out I didn't need. Really, well, I shouldn't say I didn't need the ancestral energies, not just yet. On the spot, so I'm able to chill here for a bit, try and get some um, the rest of the mushrooms, like I said. But what I might do is each one after the fact because there is no possible way for me to predict it like I did for the first one. So, <clears throat> yeah. Um, hopefully, I can finish this off quickly so that I can get the video sometime today. And you might be hearing the fan in the background now because it's currently midday in Jamaica, which is quite hot. So I apologize for the excessive noise, but I couldn't keep it off in the locker. Apologies. The mushroom boil thing. I realized that I had already collected all of them, so I'm done with the, this side of it. There's still the you know, uncharted paths that I need to get to, finish those off before I can actually be finished. And I just have to wait for that. Let's have a look and see where this goes. Positive energies. I think I need that one though. To 16, not bad. Well, making progress. And what's this? What's this? this is positive and negative. Ah, interesting. And there's another mushroom sure cluster there. Well, yeah. That's going to do it for this episode. Probably in the next one, there will be more 
probably more play on farm related things and maybe more bossing, maybe more farming. Maybe more art things to be fair. I could end up doing mini quests, I'm not entirely sure. But it's going to revolve around the realm of completions. So you usually more than likely be something that's geared towards that. So that's it. I'll see you guys in the future. I'm not really sure when I'll be able to upload another video because these kind of videos are probably gonna take a while for me to get the right on the clips to put together and share it. But I'll stick to it and see what I can do. Hopefully you guys like this video and you can comment down below. I know if you do like it, if there's anything I should change, or if there's anything you want me to do instead of this, I'm open to suggestions, to be, to be honest. And this isn't going to replace the Darkest Dungeon Stygian playthrough that I said I wanted to do. It's more than likely just going to go alongside it, considering each video for the Darkest Dungeon will just be... Um, one or maybe two dungeons depending on how long the video ends up being. So yeah. Bye guys.